How's it going, everybody, and welcome back to more Pokemon Red. And I believe last time we were on our way to the Rock Tunnel so that we can get to Lavender Town or something like that. Uh, have we already fought this guy? It seems like it. Yeah, yeah, that was the that was the bug guy. All right, well, that's cool. I guess we'll move on then. Cause why the hell not? We need we we've got places to go, we've got people to see, people to fight, more people to mug actually, like this dude. Go, my super bug Pokemon, yeah. Pretty much like that. So it's gonna be pretty good. Hopefully today I'll be able to get in at least an hour of Pokemon. That that is the goal here, but you never know. You never know. I kinda wish Dig had more uh more PP. It's kind of funny when you say it like that, but you know, I, I think you get what I'm trying to to say here. I wish there were more more times that I could use dig. So yeah. Oh well. I guess we'll just have to we'll just have to go with scratch every now now and then. Oh great! I learned sand attack. Are you serious? Learn sand attack at level 24. Unbelievable. Really. Unbelievable. Well, we'll use Dig against Weedle, so we can avoid Poison Sting, like a boss. Oh, yeah, so good. So, so good. Benonet, yes, I will switch out. Unfortunately, I just have to. I don't even know why I switched into Aragorn. There's probably someone better, like Solar, or, well, probably not Solar, but like Jetstream. Oh well, whatever. It's cool. We've got we've got this. We've got this one in the bag. There we go. Look, paralyzed. And yet it still used tackle because it's a son of a bitch. So, oh well. Horn and tackle finish it off, and it'll be be pretty good. Be pretty good. So right now, I I actually am working on a pilot for something that I can't exactly talk about yet. Not not that I can't really talk about it. But I kind of don't want to jump the gun on this thing that I'm doing and like tell everything just yet because uh, some some stuff hasn't come to pass yet. It's in it's in the work, so you know you can look forward to me definitely laying you in and filling you in on more of it when things things happen. You know I, I know I'll definitely talk about it on Twitter. And holy shit, are you serious? Are you kidding me right now? Wow. Unbelievable. Damn, Kwame. You got your ass beat. Holy shit. All right. Oh, you're going to you're going to do the whole Diglet thing too, huh? All right. No way. I I can I use this against you and do well? Yes, I can. Haha. -ha. So good. But yeah, there there are things that haven't come to pass yet that are in the works. But all I can say is that I am working on a pilot for something, so you know you can look forward to that if and when it does come out, because that would be very, very great. And then I can let you know more about it when I hear back from my contact on that. So pretty exciting stuff. I've been up. I got up early this morning. It's actually still morning here, but it's almost afternoon. It's about 11 o'clock. So. Yeah, but I got up pretty early so that I could work on it. There are some things we've been we've been emailing each other back and forth on the direction that we want to take this pilot in, and it's for you too, by the way. But uh, I've I've sent you know I've, I'm uploading I'm actually uploading the video the the pilot right now, the revised pilot the revised revised pilot, and then we'll see where everything goes from there because I'm just trying to produce the best material possible. And I know that my guy would like to have the best material possible, obviously. So, yeah, but that's that's what's going on with that. It's pretty pretty great. I don't know. I, I have a lot to do kind of early on in the day because I have work at 2.30 in the afternoon. So, yeah, lots to do. Lots to be excited about. Lots to record. Like I said, I'm going to try and record an hour of this today, and then I also have to record some, uh, some Devil May Cry, some DMCs, 
later. Probably when I get home. Either when I get home or tomorrow, because I actually have off for the next two days, I think. Something like that, so... I'll be able to get in a whole bunch of recording, which would be very, very nice. So yeah, it would be pretty great. Pretty good. I know every time I mention that when I play this game that once we get through one of the one of the games, which will more than likely be DMC, I'll be starting up uh, Dark Souls again and trying to finish that. And then once that's done, I'll probably be doing either if Dark Souls finishes first or Pokemon finishes first, which I'm sure Dark Souls will end up finishing first. I'll be moving on to Metal Gear Rising, and then I also want to do the new Tomb Raider, which would be pretty, pretty good, and start probably start up an, another Mario hack, another Mario hack and stuff. I, I actually this this weekend, this past weekend, I actually ended up buying Sim City, so I'll probably do some episodes on that just for you know, for fun. It's just like Lolar Copter Sin City or Sim City. Why did I say Sin City? I don't know. I guess I have Blank City on the mind, but... Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty fun. I had a lot more fun, and I got a lot more emotionally invested in that game than I ever thought I would, because I've never really been a fan of the Sim City or just the Sims uh, franchise in general. It's never really been my thing. So, I was actually pretty surprised with myself when I kind of decided to buy the game. I was kind of tossing back and forth on it, and I was like, you know what, it'll be probably a good game to play, you know, just when I'm bored, or just a nice calming game every once in a while, and like I said, I I had done the tutorial, and I got a lot more invested into it, because once I was done with that, I started my own city, and, you know, three hours had passed, I played for like, you know, two, three hours, and I was like, holy shit, like, I didn't even, I didn't even know, like, how or why that was going to happen, but it did, and, you know, it was, it was really, really fun, though. It was really fun. I've been playing a lot more, just trying to get used to all the, all the functions of certain buildings and whatnot, and trying to create an optimal city, but, uh, I'll probably record some SimCity, probably over the weekend, and then you guys can see some of that sparse throughout here and there. Probably, you know, because I usually only do one episode of stuff a day. Because SimCity is kind of not really a, a consistent series, I guess I could say. You'll probably see, you know, it peppered throughout all my other uploads. Like, it'll be an extra upload on a day where I'm just like, hey, you know, you guys... I, I feel like you guys want something extra, or I want to put something extra out today, like an extra video, so here you go. Something like that, so... That's what I'll try, that's what I'll try and do, that's the plan. I don't know how well, you know, that's gonna work, but, you know, we'll see, we'll go for it. It's, it's a series, it's gonna be something that I can enjoy just to do at a very leisurely, leisurely pl leisurely pace. Ugh. It's just like, blah, 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 blah today, I can't talk, so. Yeah, but it'll be pretty fun. Lots, of, lots of really good stuff happening good good things happening so I'm pretty pretty happy about that things are working out for the better for the better and not for the worse which is good which is good can I catch anything in here anything crazy like a fire type Pokemon uh, there's a volt orb I don't know if I want a volt orb huh do I want a Voltorb? This is like the exact wrong Pokemon to have out too because it's uh, water. I don't know. I don't know if I want a Voltorb. Hmm. Let's keep. Let's walk around for a little bit more. Let's kind of meander through the grass here and see what else we can see. What else we can find? An Ekans? Nope. Don't need. Don't need poison. Already got that. My Aragorn is doing quite well. Thank you very much. Unfortunately, we will not be taking your job application today, Ekans, but, uh, you know, maybe next time. Maybe next game, maybe next, uh, next series, you know? Something like that. God damn it, I said no. Now, I know, I know you really want this job. But the position has been filled. Thank you very much. 
I am sorry. I would take you on if I could, but... Right now, it's not the time nor the place. Oh, a Spearow. I don't really... I don't want one of you either. I have a Pokemon that, you know, is in mind. In my mind, anyway, for... For flight. And you're not it, Spearow. Sorry. Sorry, bud. Can't do it. Not this time. Damn it! You are back again. This is quite the persistent field here. Quite the persistent field of applicants for jobs. Honestly, I wish I could hire all of you, but... Alas, that is just not... It is not possible right now. It is not possible. I do not have the income, nor do I have the... The space. Hmm. Do I really want a Voltorb? I don't know. I kind of want... Uh, nah, you know what? We're not gonna... I know which electric, electric Pokemon I want. I want a Jolteon. That's what I want. So when I get my... When I get my Eevee, I'll try to evolve it into a Jolteon. I think that'll be pretty good. That'll be pretty good. For a Fire-type, I don't know what I would want exactly. I was thinking Flareon, but now that I've decided on Jolteon, I either am going to get a... Ponyta, which will turn into a Rapidash, or... And, uh, uh, what am I thinking of? I might get a Vulpix if I can. No, wait, this is red version, so I probably won't get a Vulpix, so... I'll either get, uh, an Arcanine, maybe. An Arcanine. I, I can't believe I'm forgetting the... The inherent, uh, Pokemon that it starts as... Which is dumb, but I'm sure I'll see it. And then I'll feel really stupid. That's, I, I should, honestly, I feel kind of ashamed, because... You know, I grew up on this generation, so I'm just like, her dee -der, forgetting all the stuff. It's pretty great. It's pretty good. Alright. Dig. Yeah. Dead. Oh, so good, Kwame. Kwame, why are you so good? Clefairy, yes, we'll switch out for... Actually, no, you know what? We'll, we'll stick with it. We'll stick to our guns here. We're doing, we're doing pretty good, so... We'll go with what must be done. Critical hit, holy shit. Oh yeah. So good. Blew it again. Lullercopters. Alright. Do I have an escape rope? I need to make sure. Yeah, okay, I have an escape rope. Good. Good. Rock tunnel. Are you guys ready to be annoyed? I'm ready to be annoyed because I don't have flash. I don't remember where... I get flash. Holy shit, it is so dark in here. Wow. Whatever, screw it. We're gonna do this. We are gonna do this in the dark. It's gonna be pretty good. It's gonna be pretty good. Well, how well does Dig work on you, Machop? Let's find out. Wow. Pretty good. Actually, to make this go a little bit faster... Or actually, this will probably get me into more battles, so we're gonna use the bike. Kinda search around. Uh, oh well. Ah, uh, Geodude. No, no, Geodude. Nope. Nice try, though. We'll, we'll do this, though. Yep, that is what we'll do. We're gonna be using the bike, and we're gonna try and get through the cave as fast as humanly possible. Because it is fucking dark in here. Holy shit. I forgot just how dark it got in here, and... Oh, traitor battle! Not that I could see it. Except for when we go to the screen for some reason, but... Alright. Okay, Cubone. Cubone is a pretty scary dude. Can Dig... Does Dig work on Cubone? Let's find out. Yes, it does. Nice. Alright. Wow, that was a critical hit, are you serious? Okay, we're doing that again. Just so that we can avoid bullshit. There we go. Another critical strike, very good. Very nice. Slow poke, yes. Huh, what could I do here? Yeah, we're gonna go with you. We're gonna go with the king here. The king! Body slam! Alright. Aw. 
confusion. Well, see ya. Nice fight, though. Good try, Mr. Pokemaniac or whatever. Yeah. Yep, game over. Game over, man. Got some money, which is nice. There are probably items in here that I'm gonna miss that people will probably be pissed off about, but... Oh well. Like I said, I'm trying to get through here as, as fast as possible. I don't really care about exploring this area right now. That is not... That is not in my immediate concern. Like I said, just trying to survive. Holy shit. Okay, dig time. Wow. Oh yeah, of course it's gonna miss. Yeah, awesome. Oh boy, Kwame. Ugh, your defense is pretty terrible. Hopefully you live. That'll be great. Critical hit? Are you fucking... You gotta be kidding me here. Wow, okay. No defense for that mole. Oh, great. And now I've been supersonic. That's awesome. Can you... Like, not... Okay, thank you. I was gonna say, if you... I swear to God, Jetstream, if you hurt yourself... That could be the final straw here. There we go. Let's... Let's give you a super potion. Because, my God. You just ate shit there. Alright. There we go. Uh... Okay... Let's see. Hey, trainer! Alright. I draw Pokemon when I'm home. Wow. That's cool. That's, uh, that's an interesting hobby, I guess. I don't know. Whoa! Level 25! Let's, let's do this! Alright. What's going on here? Wow, not a whole lot. Ugh. And, alright, that's, that's not too bad. That's not terrible. You know, all things considering. Ugh. Live? No! What? What the hell? Seriously, Kwame. What is going on? Why are you so weak as far as defense goes? It doesn't make sense. You're like in the ground, man. Well. Oh well. One day, it will be a Doug Trio. But it is not this day, unfortunately. Not this day. Let's see. Anything over here? No. So the path must be up this way. Hey, another fight. I don't often come here, but I will fight you. I don't often come here either, if you know what I mean. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh boy. That was disgusting. Anyway. So here we go. Let's, uh, Mega Punch. Mega Punch this guy in the mouth. Wipe that smile off his face. Yep. Sure did. Sure did. Alright, Bulbasaur. Mistake to keep Jetstream out? Absolutely. Will I keep him out? Yes, I will. Because I'm rebellious like that. Oh, man. Growl, you could have used any other attack. You could have used some kind of grass move, and that would have been way better than Growl. Like, why do you still have Growl? That's just... That is just dumb. That is dumb. That is ridiculous. That is absurd. Growl. Who keeps Growl at level 22? Honestly. Like, seriously. Who does that? What kind of trainer does that? I'll tell you what. A trainer that's kind of a bitch. Kind of mean. Your Pokemon deserve better than Growl. Growl is ridiculous. It's re damn ridiculous. And here's an Onix. An Onix that looks very, very menacing, but... Is dead. So, see ya. Nice try, though. That's cool. Oh, hey, alright, do you know about costume players? You mean... Cosplay? Is that... is that what you're getting at? Cosplay? Yes, I do. Some cosplay is good, some cosplay is bad. It's all a matter of perspective. But hey, you know what? Regardless of whether it's good or bad, I tip my hat off to you if you do cosplay, because... that takes... takes guts to put yourself out there, and... I don't have that, so I will not... I, I generally don't do that. I feel uh, I feel embarrassed to do that, so... But that's just me. Like I said, tip my hat off to you if you do that kind of stuff. It's pretty awesome. 
pretty awesome of you to put yourself out there. You should be proud. In all seriousness, I mean, you should be. Because it's, it's cool. It's really, really cool. So there we go. Alright. Yeah. Well, that's that. It is indeed. Man, we are getting attacked a lot. By a Zubat, nonetheless. Alright. Surprisingly, surprisingly, we haven't run into too many Zubats in this cave, which is good. I am very happy about that, but of course, now that I've said that, luck will dictate that I'm probably going to be running into a lot of Zubats, and I'm going to be pretty pissed off at myself for for uh, jinxing myself in such a manner. But oh well. Yeah, let's find out. Is it Zubat? Yep. Goddamn Zubat. I need some water. <laughs> So Aragorn, how are we going to deal with the Zubat? Let's body slam the Zubat in the wings. Because why not? I don't even know as a flying type why you would let that happen, but... Alright. Looks like these Zubats aren't on their A-game today. Considering that they are bats and are blind, that kind of makes sense, but I mean... There's so much noise happening around, in fact I'd have to charge charge you on the ground for a body slam, so you should be able to move out of the way considering that you can hear and see with your echo location. But that might not always be the case, so there we go. Either way, though, we're doing quite well, and like I said, running into a lot of Zubats. Alright. Ah, trainer. My Pokemon techniques will leave you crying. Alright, well, we'll find out, won't we? Oh, it's a hiker. Alright. Sent out a Geodude. Oh boy. Level 25 Geodude. Alright. Let's do this thing. Aw oh, man. Ugh, self-destruct, come on. Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. Duh. Oh, 2 HP, yes. So good, and a level up because you are awesome, Aragorn. Yes. Yeah, you're right, I am good. How are you being a tactician when you use... when the only move that you use at the start is self-destruct? You didn't even try to fight me. You were just being a little bitch, so... Gee, thanks for that. Thanks a lot. Alright. Is the ladder up here, I wonder? Let's find out. Is the ladder up here? I'm probably missing a whole bunch of trainers, but... Like I said, the goal is to is to win as fast as possible. So that is what I'm doing here. All right, not very effective. That's okay. Defense fell. That's good. Defense falling is good. You know, for being a not very effective attack, it did a pretty good amount of damage. So this cut should take it out. Yep. All right, all right. Ah, there's the ladder. I thought so. Oh boy, Geo dude. Annoying. Oh, looks like I can get some HP back and kill it. Yeah, buddy! Alright. Into the ladder. Wow. That was a really weird effect. I guess it looks a lot stranger when it's pitch black. Because it's like a flash transition or something. So, whatever. Whatever. It's all good. We're good here. We're good. Super effective! Alright. Um, oh, that's probably a trainer or something, or an item. Oh well, who cares? That's a trainer, yep. Because there's a ladder out there. Outsiders like you need to show me some respect. Do I? You kind of... I was just going by. You didn't have to fight me. But you decided to. So I'll show you some respect by pounding your face into the pavement. The same thing, right? I think it's the same thing, so... That's what I'll do, because that's what this guy is obviously asking me to do. Who am I to say no? I should just oblige him, because it's the proper thing to do. It's the polite thing to do. So, bye. So much for that. Have I gained your respect yet? Have I? Let's find out. What does he say? I give. Yeah, I guess so. That's cool. So let's see here... What the hell? It almost looks like I went in a circle. Did I go in a circle? 
Is that what happened? I guess we'll find out. Did I indeed go in a circle? And if I did, how does that even work? Nope. It was just a similar looking area, I guess. Oh well. That's what I get for not using Flash, or not remembering where Flash is to get it. I'm pretty sure Professor Oak's aide gives it to you, but I don't remember where he is, so... Oh well, sad times for me. That's alright though, we're doing a pretty alright job of navigating this place. That's where we came from, so that's not where we're going. That is not where we want to go. Alright. Why does it look like Geodude has hair? Like, I know that's supposed to be, like, a rock formation on top of its head. But it looks like hair. It's really weird. Because it's really, like, kind of round. Not really pebble round. But I think, I think you get what I'm talking about, right? You can pick up what I'm throwing down here. You got this. You've got this. If you stuck around long enough, you understand what I mean. You get the gist of what I am saying. So there we go. Just saying. Ho ho! Wink wink, Goku. Yep. Hikers leave twigs as trail markers. That's cool, I guess. Like Hansel and Gretel dropping breadcrumbs. Oh boy. The Grim story, the Grim version of that story ended up pretty bad, didn't it? It sure did. It sure did. That was pretty scary. But oh well. That's what happens when you wander off on the in the woods. You have no idea where you're going. And you happen upon a candy cabin. Or castle or whatever. And there's a nice old lady, presumably, inside. And she's like, just come in and eat whatever you want. And then, you know, you're dumb. And you get eaten. And thrown into a furnace and stuff. It's, it's pretty bad. Or an oven. You know? It's not good. It's not good. If you find a candy land inside the, a scary looking wooded area, do not go in. That is that is the moral of the story there. I think that's that's the gist of what they're trying to get at. Don't do that. Oh, payday. Come on. Come on now, Meowth. Don't be a little bitch. Thank you. All right. But thanks to Payday, I think I should get some extra money, or whatever, I don't know. There are coins everywhere, so maybe I lost some money. Maybe that's what it was. Oh no, no, I got some extra money. Nice! Aww. Can I beat your power? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. So what are you doing here? You've got a Geo dude. Cool. Well... It's a bad day for you, unfortunately, as you can see here. This guy did not know I had a gloom lurking about, but now he does. And because he started this battle, he can't run away, because I can't run away either. Which is fine, you shouldn't really be able to do... I, I think in an honorable fight, that should not be the case. Not that this is that honorable, because this guy kind of jumped me. But, you know... In a trainer-to-trainer -trainer battle, that's not mean-spirited, I guess. You shouldn't be able to run. And that is what we are doing right now, not running. Because we don't need to. We've got this down and pat. We're good. We are good to go. Alright, 600-something experience, which is good. Oops, out-muscled. Yeah, you are. You're also kind of a douchebag, but... You know, I'm sure my character won't say that to you, because my character is a pretty nice person as far as I'm personifying them, in the game anyway. As the narrator, I can say whatever I want. So, that's what I do. And that's what I've been doing. So there you go. Anyway, how and where am I going to get out of here? I hope I'm picking the right path here. Certainly do, certainly do. Alright, water gun! When does War Turtle learn Bubble Beam? I thought I would have learned it by now, unless in this game, Bubble Beam can only be taught by TM, which I'm sure I have right now. Oh, you you want my po you want a Pokedex like mine? Too bad. You didn't grow up in Palatown. You don't know Professor Oak. 
I know Professor Oak. He's kind of a creepy, you know, old guy that does black market Pokemon dealings. Which would explain why certain people, well, a lot of people, especially later on in the Pokemon...